the Star Wars prequels are full of some strange lines. I'm haunted by the kiss that you should never have given me. But few lines cause quite as much head scratching as this. Only a Sith deals in absolutes. Whoa, that's a pretty rigid, dogmatic, absolutist statement, huh, Obi-Wan? Hypocrite much? Actually, I don't think so. So you're off the hook, Obi-Wan. For now. And why do I say that? Because I think a lot of viewers miss some critical information here. Understanding this line has a lot to do with defining these words in ways that are actually consistent with the evidence. Obi-Wan actually fights for absolute truth only minutes later as he duels Anakin. Anakin, Chancellor Palpatine is evil! From my point of view, the Jedi are evil! What we see here is basically Obi-Wan saying, Absolute truth! Objective, good and evil, and whatever. No qualifiers. And Anakin saying, Subjective truth! It's not an objective fact that the Jedi are evil. I just think they are, from my perspective. Because they hurt me personally. He's holding me back! And we see a very incriminating line from Palpatine earlier in the film. Good is a point of view, Anakin. Whoa, so you're telling me that the Sith are in fact, like, the opposite of dealing in absolutes? Well, no. Believing in an absolute and dealing in one are not the same thing. After all, this word deals has to do with external action towards others, not internal personal convictions. This deal is getting worse all the time. We will deal with your rebel friends soon enough. Only a Sith deals in absolutes. Obi-Wan is using deal in the sense of a negotiation or an agreement. After all, Anakin hasn't made a declaration of belief here. He's issued an ultimatum, much akin to join me or die. Don't make me kill you. It's a false dichotomy that leaves Obi-Wan no option. When Obi-Wan says only a Sith deals in absolutes, he's saying only a Sith negotiates in false dichotomies that involve submission to their point of view or death. If you will not be dead, you will be destroyed. For the Sith, good is anything that gives them power. I can feel your anger. It gives you focus, makes you stronger. And evil is anything that hurts them personally. You thunder against me! So the Sith are relativists with subjective views of good and evil. Not just the dogmatic, narrow view of the Jedi. But they deal in absolutes all the time. He will join us or die. Anakin is clearly using join me or die language. It extended to Padme, and it extended to Obi-Wan, and neither of them considered themselves Anakin's enemy. I love you. You were my brother, Anakin. There's more nuance to this situation than Anakin is allowing. Shades of gray that a Sith, blinded by his own selfish goals and warped view, simply won't consider in his dealings. Only a Sith deals in absolutes. 